Hi, this is Karen with the Kind Garden Stuff. It's been a couple months since I've been with you. Um, thank you for coming with me on my channel. Today I'm going to feed the worm garden. And it's been a couple months since you've seen this. So let me go ahead and uncover this and bring it back. All right, here I am back again. Here is what it looks like right now. Um, beginning from there, I've stopped giving the wild bird seed just to see what it would look like. And I also noticed let me show you right here. Like, there were spots that were barren, not barren, um, th really thin, that they've eaten through most of the cardboard and paper shreddings, and the worms were really small. So... I am going to try and stick with the ratio of um, twice as many carbon as greens. And so that's what I've been doing from that point. I go from there to there, and then it'll just, and I feed it twice a week. So it'll take about one month to get back to the same spot. So let me dig in here really quick. I just wanted to see pretty much how, um, what the worms look like. Are they bigger? Are they smaller? Because they were really teeny. You know, like when they don't have enough food, there's a ton of them, but they were all teeny. And I thought they were all babies, but I don't think they were all babies. I think they just didn't have enough food. And they tend not to move far from where they're currently at. They'll just keep on eating and eating and eating uh, wherever they're at. So let me... Well, there's, there's a lot of worms here. Let's see if you can see it. Yeah, there's a lot of worms in here. Hang on a second. I wear glasses and I can't see close with my glasses just far. So let me take my glasses off so I can see if you're seeing what I'm seeing. So there are a lot of worms and see this one. That one has a clitellum already, but it's not very big. It's not very large. So that means it's either not going to grow very large or it just needs more food because it's shrinking. It's mature, but it's... And that's what happens when there's not much food left. They start to shrink. And then they shrink and then they shrink and then you think they're all babies, but they're not babies. They're just not enough food and you see here how you know this is all that's left of what I fed them so to me that indicates they need to be fed either more or more often and as I dig here let me see what's down here I'm going to dig all the way down to the bottom And it's not very deep. Um, maybe only three inches at this point. What the heck is this? Oh, that's a pumpkin stem. Huh. All right. Uh, so that's going to take forever. Let's see what's all the way down here.
Oh dear, looks like I got cut off. Um, all right, I just wanted to show you right here. So this is my out outdoor worm bin, and there's just a ton of worms in here. I'm not going to show you um, feeding them because you've seen that before, and it's just the same old, same old. But um, but they're growing, and I'm happy. And the daytime temperatures have been oh mid 90, mid 90s, 97 degree Fahrenheit at day, and in the nighttime maybe mid 70s. So it's still pretty warm. I try to uh, water them twice a day. So that's what I'll do with them after I feed them up. But it um, looks like they're doing okay. I just want to try and get them bigger. So that means I just need them, feed them more often and more. So that's it for me. Thank you for coming with me to check on my worms. And if there's anything that specific that you'd like me to show you, please um, indicate so in the comment section below. Um, if you like my videos, please um, like them and share them. And um, I thank you so much for coming on this journey with me.